everybody! Welcome back to today's video! How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing wonderful, amazing, great, just okay, anyhow, manyhow. Anyway, hi! My name is Angie. Welcome back to today's video. Um, don't forget you can subscribe to my channel if you want to. You can also follow me on Instagram at AngieBear. And today, let's first talk about how it is my my favorite month of the year because it is now april and if you do not know this april is my birthday month so <laughs> i thought i would do a little video to talk about some of the skincare and makeup purchases that i bought last month <laughs> anyway yeah a bit weird so once again you see me uh, bare face i don't have makeup on today because I just want to show you guys what I bought and what I am super excited to try. Most of it I've tried before, but also show you guys some of the products that I always, always repurchase. So if you want to watch and you want to find out what those products are, then just keep on watching. Okay, so let's just get into today's video. I don't think I've I, I bought a lot of products in March. Maybe I did, maybe I didn't, I do not know, but I will just get those products that I always repurchase out of the way first and probably tell you guys why I always repurchase these products. Lah. So and I will also tell you where I got the products because in March we had like this very big Sephora sale. Although I didn't buy a lot of uh, products, I'll explain why later. And there was also uh, an Estee Lauder, uh, what do you call that? Friends and Family Sale. Mm, yes. So basically, I'm going to show you first the products that I repurchase. And normally, as always, these are like some of my favorite products that I always use. And obviously, I had to get it. This was, uh, I got this at the Estee Lauder friends and family sale so this one was at a very big discounted price and obviously it's the origins mega mushroom relief and resilience treatment lotion so uh, if you've seen my previous video you know that i always use this as well as my toner after i wash my face so this time i bought like the big bottle lah. so really i'm i'm trying to finish like my spray bottle so i can just use that to spray 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 instead of like kick, 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 kick patting it into my face so this is the one that I bought and the other ones that obviously I will always buy is my right or dyes which is lots of time it's still in the box as you can see I haven't opened it yet because obviously I still have those products with me but let me also explain why I have these products with me and that is because I am a gold member or yeah I am a gold member in lots of time here in Malaysia so like as you buy and you collect points not only do you get uh, as a gold member five percent discount uh, for every purchase but you also collect points so the points that you collect you can use to redeem cash vouchers and i had about 200 ringgit so what do you buy you buy the biggest size reset serum because this one hella expensive and you get 200 it's like literally 50 percent discount for this size so i got that and i also got the youth oil and if you watched my previous video if you have not watched it i will link it somewhere here in the card or i'll put it in my description box below but this is basically my go-to um third and fourth step in my nighttime routine that uh, sort of like helps save my skin a little bit lah. so this one's and then of course you've seen me already do that video about my nude sticks uh, so that i went for the masterclass so i bought some of their products so i just put this out of the way okay so some of the different things that i that i've never tried yet on my channel i'm gonna show you guys is this clinique compact powder okay the only reason i bought this was because the friend and friend friends and family sale on estee lauder this one was 60 ringgit and it just looks like this like it's just basically a pressed powder i do not own any pressed powder so i thought i would try and yeah i mean it's just a basic pressed powder la. not like so yaya papaya ra ra it's just basic so i got that and then during the sephora sale i actually wanted to buy the rare beauty uh bronzing stick but it was all sold out and i was super super upset because a lot of the products that i put in my 
cart basically was taken out because it was already sold out and before the sales start right they will encourage you to like add things to your cart it's so pointless because I could never get any of those things I put like I think four or five items in my cart in the end I only received one item because that was the only item that I managed to purchase the rest was all the, the rest were all sold out so I was really irritated but I went in store and I decided to buy the what is this? The Illuminating Primer from Rare Beauty. So I'm really excited to try this uh, here. I will show you guys. Very little bit because it's expensive. And it looks like this. You see it? It's like... Uh, So it's a primer that basically illuminates your skin lah, like what it says. So I super super love this. Like it gives me that like that glow, uh, ala like glass skin look. Super like super 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 like yeah. Look. It just has like you know the typical like formula kind of smell lah. So I bought this. Mm, really really, I used it only like once, and I already really liked it. And I use it normally with this, which I bought during the friends and family sale as well. This is the Bobbi Brown ISSF SPF Foundation 40 PA blah 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 plus 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 basically. And I got such a great deal out of this. If you seen like some of my older videos, I have like the old one, like the very old one, the one where you still like. Uh, I don't know what you call that thing, but you press press one. This one is the one with the pump. So this is like the new packaging type. And let me tell you, I was so proud of myself because when I bought this, uh, obviously there were only a few shades lah, and I managed to like match the exact shade. And on top of that, it was buy one free one. <laughs> so I had two of these products. And I bought it for 150 ringgit for two, for two, for two. But obviously, then you just have to like decide lah, like when the manufacturing date is. And yeah, so I bought and I am in the shade Golden Beige. And it actually really matched it lah. So I'm just gonna put it here a bit. Here. And look at that. Can you see that? Okay, let me just put it a little bit more. No! Yeah. And I think this one is turning out to be one of my favorite type of foundation already because you know I don't like super full coverage and I'm totally okay with my pimples and my redness coming through from my foundation but this one it's also very light coverage but it's like the so-called like glass skin look type lah, and it matched really well. So I really like it and it's very easy to wear. Sometimes we still have to wear masks so it looks it looks okay. I really like it. I really love this. Not just like I really love this actually. It's very nice. It's very nice. It's very nice. It's very nice. And it was such a good deal. So I'm happy. I'm happy. I am very happy. And I'm going to show you the only thing that I managed to buy during the Sephora sale online and it is this. This is actually the Nude Sticks um, Blend and Buff Brush and this is the only thing that I managed to get from the Sephora sale. Yeah, so this one is like the you buff your eyeshadow and then this one is you blend your foundation. So. As you can see, I haven't used this. This is still clean and this one is like dirty already because I've been using it to like uh, blend my eyeshadow uh, when I'm using the Nude Sticks products. Super, super love. Uh, very easy to use lah and what to do, the only thing that I got. And the final product that I bought in March that I went in store to buy lah. So initially when I put it in my cart, I was thinking that I would get it and this was the one of the items that was taken out of my cart because it apparently sold out and it is this. This is the Fortify Eye... What's this? Eye patch? Yeah, eye patches 
from Pixie and it is supposed to be toning eye patches to instantly tone and lift and restore your under eye area so I've used this twice and if you know me personally you know I do not use eye cream I don't have any under eye mask or whatever so I wanted to try because you know we had the discount and I bought it I used it twice Fortunately, I don't like it and it also cements the fact why I don't like to use under eye stuff. Um, it didn't feel good la, and after using it, you can see here, this, 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 this. So, and then it felt like a bit too tingly for my liking, like I'm not comfortable with those kind of tingling under my eye. So, yeah, probably just give it to home home. <laughs> And yeah, actually that is it. That is it. I was actually very excited to like do a video about the about uh, the Maybelline Sky High mascara uh, when we managed to like pre-order it to buy it. But what I have here is like a we are sorry package because we didn't receive the mascara, but they did send us a an apology. That's one. And like some other like uh, like tester kits or oh sorry travel kits, trials kits. I don't know, man. But um, because I don't use Maybelline products, um, I just left it in there. They also gave us like some Fit Me foundations, which I don't use because it was not in my shade. But yeah, those are just some of the things, uh, skincare and makeup related products that I bought in March. Uh, more money spent as per usual uh, which i'm very excited maybe in my next video i would do a full face using the bobby brown issf mm, yes but i think first and foremost i just want to make sure i enjoy this april because yes it's my birthday month i want to be able to enjoy and uh, first of april onwards our borders are open for traveling in malaysia so i'm really excited to want to leave the country to like visit my loved ones and yeah hopefully i can do that soon and that's today's video don't forget you can subscribe and if you want to follow me on instagram you can also do that at angie bear and i'll see you guys in the next video bye